Hi everyone. So I've been asked by a customer how to save a motion clip um, or performance from your character. Uh, I save an action menu item in some of my props that I do and that's basically taking the sequence of sprites that we animate through and saving those as an item within that particular prop or asset. Um, this here is taking the motion and, and animation from a character or a prop or whatever it is and saving that out to be applied to different characters or different items. So this here is uh, good old Fred. He's doing a little bit of a pop-up here. And we're just going to save this out. So all you have to do is come down to collect clip and you'll get this bar come through here um, now one thing to note it's only going to save what's visible uh, so you need to select your character and well, this is how I do it anyway go through each of the bones that you know have been animated and expose them in the timeline here same goes for any sprites that you've done so sprite editor and I know that I've done the right hand because this is mirrored um, as well as the left and right eye and then the mouth I'm pretty sure that's all so once all of those keys are exposed and we've got collect clip turn on all we have to do is click and drag within that same space to select a certain range that we want and this is including a bit of a still a few frames at the end there once that's selected we right click and this is where you have your different options of saving so normally I'll save out the sprite sequences as an action menu and like I said that basically gets added to that particular prop when you save it into your content manager um, this one here we actually just want the performance of it to be able to apply it to other characters so export perform there and I'll save over the top of this one Fred wave and then all we have to do I'll just make a bit of room is come into animation go to your custom and perform and then you'll see it here and like most of the props in that you can save yourself a thumbnail to give it a better representation and that is it so from there we can grab our other Fred that's sitting here with nothing on him so he's got no animation on him and if I just double click that it'll apply it as a motion so if we pull back we can see both of these guys doing the same thing It's easy as that. Hope that helps. Happy animating.